Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're having an issue where your Bluetooth appears to be having a delay with the audio output. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the start menu. Type in troubleshoot. Best result should come back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and open this up. Select additional troubleshooters on the right panel here. And then you want to select underneath find and fix other problems, Bluetooth, find and fix problems with Bluetooth devices, and select run the troubleshooter. And I'd recommend following along with any of the on-screen prompts here and see if that resolves the problem. Something else you can try here too if you open up the star menu and type in device manager. Best results should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. So now you want to go ahead and expand Bluetooth. If you see Bluetooth in here, so hopefully you'd see Bluetooth. I don't have any Bluetooth devices hooked up so that's why you don't see any in here. But on your end there should be something that says Bluetooth. Go ahead and just double click on the Bluetooth entry and then for your Bluetooth device listed under there, you go ahead and right click on it and select update driver. You would select browse my computer for drivers and then select let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Go ahead and select the Bluetooth specific one. So if there's a generic one you can select it but if there's a manufacturer specific one I'd recommend going with that one. And then select next. Once it's done click on close and you might have to restart your computer to see if that resolves the problem. One further thing you can try here would be to open up the start menu, type in services, best match, should come back with services. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to locate the Windows Audio Service and double click on it. You want to make sure the startup type is set to automatic and if the service is stopped you want to go ahead and start the service. So if you have to make any changes, you go ahead and select apply and OK to save them. And then finally, if you close out of here and you open up the start menu, type in control panel. Type in control panel. Best result should come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. For the view by up here, set it to large icons and then select the sound. Select your speaker output and then select properties. In the enhancements tab, left click on it. And you want to disable all enhancements and select apply and OK. Do the same thing for the recording device in here. So select it and then select properties. If there's an enhancements tab over here, you'd also want to click on it and disable the enhancements. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope that I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.